Sir, Lieutenant Casey reporting as ordered. Take your seat, Lieutenant. Thank you, sir. I've looked over your record. Very impressive. Thank you, sir. And our computer tells us you have a good probability for success in high altitude reconnaissance training. I know you've fought hard to get in. Initiative and tenacity. I admire that. The only thing I question, I worry that you don't know what you're in for with this particular aspect of the training. I can imagine it, sir. Can you? Lieutenant, this is the toughest escape and evasion course in the military. Now, most do not get through it. I'm aware of that, sir. Well, perhaps you can tell me more specifically what you hope to gain from this training. Do you realize, of course, that as a woman, you won't get a posting? We're considered a combat operation even in peacetime. I know how things are now, sir. But they may change. And I want to be qualified when they do. Please don't misunderstand me. I'm not trying to discourage you. But I do feel it's my duty to warn you. The course has not been altered to accommodate you in any way. There will be no special treatment here. I wouldn't want it differently, sir. Well, that'll be all, Lieutenant. Good luck. Thank you, sir. say that about every damn course, right? How bad can it be? I've been through them all, except this one. Not real pleasant, but not that tough. It's a piece of cake, as I see it. <laughs> of course, I could be wrong. <laughs> Where'd you get all this info, anyway? I know this chick that works in the computer center, so what's that get you? They got me a look at the course ring. I don't know about all this computer stuff. I just, I just want a little action. No? Yeah, that's the good I'm just pissed that anyone is going to Manila tonight. There you go. I know a couple of real nice places. The object of the course is simple. Don't get caught. If you do, escape. Your base, unit, and mission, as outlined in your fictitious flight protocol, must be kept secret at any cost. That is what the opposition forces will be after. The maps that we've provided for you. Give the approximate location and description of the safe area. You will be working in teams of two. You'll be paired up at drop time. The drop plane will make only one return pass over the zone. If you or your partner are injured in the jump, that is the time to fire your signal flare. Otherwise, it could be a while before we know you were hurt. Some of you have been through what you think are similar training courses in the past. Well, let me tell you. The infamous course at Camp Lejeune it's a walk in the park compared to this one. May I remind you that regulations prohibit discussion of any kind regarding this course? That will be all. There will be no questions. Oh, 
Conway and Webb. Casey and Ripken. Logan and Bond. Head towards the shoreline, get our bearings from there. Good idea. You do that. Great. Boss? Hello, sir. Uh, your senior officer, Major. Rank doesn't so... count out here. But name's Logan. Oh. Let's see that. Say, is your leg okay? Well, yeah, I figure if we keep the beach behind our back, that way we'll know what's behind us. Let's go. Here. That sounds good to me. No injuries. What is it, Sergeant? Well, don't you think it's kind of crazy for them to send a female through here? Not my decision. Yes, I know, but... What I mean is, what are we gonna do with her? Train her. Just like everybody else. <laughs> Just so... some jungle full of ants and malaria and God knows what else. Just so I can get some thrills, I must be crazy. Of course, you gotta be a little crazy, I guess, to begin with, just to join up in the first place. I don't know, I just... I always wanted some adventure, and you ain't gonna get it in Deming, New Mexico. Population three and a half, I'll tell you. Every time I see girls, they just, I mean, Bye. it just leaves. Oh, shoot. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Major, I, I mean, Logan. I guess I've been on kind of a runaway, huh? Yeah. Don't know why I do that. I do it all the time. I'm sorry, I'm gonna shut up. I'm always done. I drive my mother bats, though. She said I used to just babble and babble in my playpen for hours, and I, I don't know why. Bots. Yes, I just naturally Bots. like to box. Can you talk to yourself and keep watch while I go up to that point and try to get our bearings? Can you do that? Yes, sir. I mean, right. Logan, I... Great. Right. I'll be you back. You go ahead and... Okay. God, why do you talk so much? It's not like you've got anything to say. Actually, the name's Logan. I know who you are, Major. What's going on? Well, it looks like Bots' first pigeon. 
That's the first prisoner taken. Let's check it out. Find your split on you, huh? How come you didn't run out on bots? I thought of it. But it just seemed kind of helpless. Look, um, you've got a limp and I've got tits. These aren't great things to have in the military, so... Why don't we pair up and get through the course as best we can? Kind of sure yourself, aren't you? My plan was to stick to the shoreline as long as possible before heading inland. Great minds. They're paired up and they're moving them on to Kona Beach. The others? Lone Ranger's right here, and the others are still sitting on their asses right here. Well, shake them up. All of them. charge here because I've been trying Shut to tell the your face asshole what hey man I'm telling you there's something wrong here and these guys they won't say a word I don't want to make waves but you're in a lot of get him out of here About here, huh? Oh boy. You hurt your leg in the jump? That would I do best. How long have you been on the ground? It's kind of obvious. Your rank and experience, chest full of medals, commendations. You must be trying to requalify. Sorry. Well, let's just say I thought it'd be easier behind a desk than it has been. Right. What about you? What about me? What are you doing here? Oh, I'm sure you've got that all figured out, Major. Little lady doing her bit for the feminist cause. Trying to be the son my father never had. No, you know, something like that. How did you get here? I found a loophole. <coughs> I think he needs a little more persuading. It's pretty big, Captain. Do you have a complaint, Sergeant? Please. I'll uh, give you a boost. Yeah. Oh, nice Reel him in, Sergeant. Sector 10. Flathead. Go to beach. Sector 4. Let's go. Move it. Let's go. Just filled your bucket, boy. Don't you think you better clean it up? Yes, sir.
the same direction. Joking. <laughs> Here, try these airplanes. You really think we're safe here? I think, Lieutenant, if they wanted to capture us, they'd come right in here and do it. Major. Major, it's time to get going. Hey! Hey! Uh, sorry. Are you always like this in the morning? I just didn't hear you, sorry. I noticed. Maybe that's why your plugs are against regulation. <laughs> <laughs> I think we better find this damn shed before the sun comes up. Okay. that hard. It was too easy, wasn't it? How the hell should I know? That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Married, Major? Divorced. Me too. Several times. You're not that old. No, I wasn't that married. <laughs> hey! Hey, what? Get easy with it! What the hell are you doing?
Right. Major, what in God's name is going on here? They're beating the crap out of us. At this point, you know more than I do. Looks like we're playing the POW game. The POW game? That is not what I signed up for. What happened to the escape and evasion course? Well, didn't evade too well, did you? Maybe you'll do better than escape. Where's Bots? That chicken shit? He's here. Major, you've got to stop this. Now, you're senior officer here. Get right up in there! Oh, at least he's talking to us. Get that man out here! What is this? Come on. Conway, Gilbert H, Lieutenant. Shut up in there. Shut up. Get him up. Get him up here. Get him up here. Sir! You will address me as sir! You are a captive here! You will take orders! You will speak only when you are spoken to! Do you get that shit face? Yes, sir. What? Yes, sir! Good! Now get your ugly ass face back in there. Move in that can. Move it, move it. Move. Hey. The rest of you bastards line up here. No, Out of no, tension. No. Out of tension. I said attention. Good. Now just hold that. Gentlemen, my name is Becker. I am the Commandant. This is Camp Becker. It is located on Becker's Island. It is staffed by Becker's men. This is Becker's world. Beckerland, if you prefer. There are no computers here. Logic will not serve you. This is what it's really about. You people think the world is all push button. I'm here to prove to you that what the military always comes down to is emotional and physical control. You are not guests. You are not invited. You will be treated like what you are. Animals. My own personal menagerie. Becker's pets. Some of you are dogs. Some of you are pigs. We'll sort that out as we go along. What's important for you to know is that I am the one and only. I am the almighty. I am the god here. And I am a vengeful god.
Most of you will not come out of this test. How shall I put it? Completely intact. That's because you're weak. My job is to cull you out and step on you. That's the job your country and, ironically, you yourselves have given me. And, gentlemen, there is one thing you may be sure of. You have been abandoned here. Close off now! I want to see a pile of it right here. Everything but the boots. Move it! Wait a minute. You got a woman here. I don't recall asking your opinion. Shut up! Get the clothes off! Stop moving! What are we waiting for? I want to see it all! Move it! Get them off! Maggot! Move it! Oh, what's the matter, Missy? You need some help, huh? Get it off! Get it off! Judging by this group, you don't need to worry about a damn thing. Come on! Get them off! Get them off! Pile them up right here! Come on! Move it! Move it! Move it! Move it! Move it! Everything! Let's go! You! What the hell are you looking at? Come here, get over here, get over here! Line up, line up! Chest the back, chest the back, close, close! Closer, damn it, closer! Make that person in front of you know you're there, move it! Eyes forward! Get your eyes front! You look at me like that again. Now we're gonna take a little shower. We're gonna delouse you! Never say we didn't do anything for you, right? Come on, move it! Get them up, up. Keep them up. Turn around, turn around. Now move. What are you waiting for? Come on. Get back in line if you got that punch them on. Come on, move it. Get over there. Get back. This for fun. You guys are way out of line. Remember, this is a training course, so there are limits. Yeah. They can rough us up, but they can't kill us. I'm starving. That box is Oh, wait. Come on, go! Oh, come on. Oh. I know you're an old pro. And you probably think all of this is just bullshit. But we gotta go through the motions. It's my job. Not gonna say anything, are you? Sir. Logan, William J. 
Major okay, 012788. Okay, okay. I know I can't intimidate you. And there's no point in me beating on you like those other punks out there. He believes it. He believes that it's his uh, sacred duty to bust these guys for their own good, uh, for the good of the country, you know, all that crap. The reason I'm telling you all of this is that for some reason or another, I think he's got it in for you. My advice to you is to be very, very careful. Tell me, Sergeant. From what old war movie did you get your routine? Kind of raw on you, huh? I'll tell you what. Why don't I just. Uh... Hey guys, listen, why don't you uh, take a break? You know, I'll tell you something. I just don't trust those bastards. They're only loyal to Becker. Ow! What's the something I say? How's it going, Lieutenant? Logan, where are you? The next condo over. Are we having fun now? Did they hurt you? They didn't punch me, if that's what you mean. It's Stafford's a jewel. Tells me all the time how crazy Becker is. Yeah, the desperate commander routine. Little truth, big lies. My that's what I figured. What'd you say to him? Played along with him. Thanked him very politely for his warning. Damned if you do, damned if you don't. How's your leg? Which one? I wonder how long we'll have to stand in these things. You ever sleep standing up? Sure. I used to do it in formation all the time. <laughs> no talking.
Top of the morning to you, Major. We thought we'd give that leg of yours a little exercise. You are good at hard labor, yes? Sir, I am a U.S. military officer. According to Geneva Convention, I cannot be forced into hard labor. Very good, Major. Now, you take this shovel. Or I'm going to shove it up your ass so you always have it. Mr. Botsy will show you the way. something, guys. Yeah, we're here. How you doing, Bats? Look, they always try to break someone down first, and they give you the worst of it. They just try to go along with it. Still can make it. And nobody will talk to me. I'll see what I can do. Have you seen Lieutenant Casey this morning? No, I haven't. I'll try to locate her, will you? Boy, yes, you haven't even tried it yet. All right, go easy. It's not his you fault. Son of a bitch! Hold it. But hold it! I don't hear him saying no. Knock it off, Lieutenant. Okay, so what do you want to know? Nothing, Botsy, nothing at all. Come on. Where's our little honey this morning? Don't see her out here breaking her sweet little ass. Get off it, Ripken. All right, Major. I forgot. She's your territory, isn't she? And what the hell is that supposed to mean? Don't think we don't know what's going on. We got the word. The word? Yeah. The word. Who from? Stafford? Well, it didn't take him too long to get to you guys, did it? And it didn't take long for the little lady to get to you, did it? You're a sick young man, Ripken. Yeah? Well, I know when I'm getting screwed. You've got no marks on your face, Major. Special treatment doesn't apply to us. You ready, guys? Yeah. yeah. It's too soon. You got nothing to say about this. It's all set up. Now, remember, we head down river. Right, down right. Okay? Let's go! <laughs>
little skimpy for my taste. <laughs> Guys here seem awfully appreciative. Sir, with all due respect, as far as I'm concerned, you are an asshole, and the boys should get distemper shots. That's some mouth you got on you, missy. I could have made it so easy for you, you know? But you want to be a hard ass. Let me tell you something. You better pull your balls up, bitch. Because Captain Becker wants to see you. Listen up, Baffert. Yes, sir. Sit, Casey. You present me with some special problems, interesting problems. I don't know what to do with you, how to treat you, how to get to you. I understand you want to be treated like everybody else, but uh, I don't think that's possible, if you know what I mean. No, sir, I don't. Conditioning can be a cruel master. No one here, not even your fellow prisoners, is able to treat you as if you were a man. A lot of what we do here is psychological. We rake up common fears, what the enemy would surely attack if a man were captured. Some physical brutality, of course, but mixed with isolation, disorientation, fear of failure, homophobia, stuff like that, standard routine. My problem is, aside from the obvious, death and so forth, I can only guess what you're afraid of because I don't know what makes you tick. You're not like anyone else here. You're different. And uh, I don't know how to test you, really test you. your hand. You gotta be kidding. Hands! Next man, hands! Just say the word and we'll send you back to the base, safe and sound. <coughs> Don't go. <coughs> Nobody expects you to make it anyway, no matter what the computers say. In fact, it'd be a victory. You'd be fulfilling expectations. <laughs> They'd tell you how proud they were of you for trying. Oh, come on, Lieutenant. You'll save us a lot of trouble and yourself a lot of pain. We don't play very nice here. Sir, no thank you, sir. All right. Put her in isolation. Ah, oui. Enjoy that toy. Well, I don't care. Never had a man through here as old and seasoned as you, Major. In fact, I don't think in all my experience I've... Well, certainly not in the three years I've been in charge here. Three years. Yeah. Long tour, huh? They were kind of in the same boat, Major. They don't know what to do with me either. So they leave me here, throw away, disposed of, you might say. And now they want to retire me. But I'm sure Stafford told you all this. He likes to talk out of turn, unlike Tuan here. You know, he once commanded a battalion. Things change. What are you doing here in this course at your age? 
That's none of your business. Isn't it? They're phasing you out of the action. You can't stand a desk. I'm afraid you can't cut it in civilian life. Jesus, I hate you fucking pilots. So goddamned arrogant. All the glory without getting your hands dirty, just like a nom. Fly out straight from village, drop a bomb back for lunch. Who cares how many women and babies get turned into dog food? If the blood could splash up and hit the clouds, it still wouldn't touch you. Because you'd have already flown on to the next village to kill the next bunch of innocent kids. I'm on the same side. And I can't stand the sight of you. Fucking long distance push button killer. Maybe somebody ought to kill your kids, Major. Huh? Maybe somebody ought to slit their throats. Then maybe you'd know who you are. You son of a bitch. Got it in one. That was easy. I thought you might be more of a challenge, Major. Guilt is so mundane. Yeah, I'm a son of a bitch. At least I'm not bullshitting myself. I know who I am and why I'm here. Wings. You're at the end of the line, too, Major, whether you know it or not. You don't rate this course. Slut, aren't you, Casey? Go ahead, put it on. Look, lady, I don't give a goddamn. You can go back in the compound like that for all I care. Will you pass out, Stevenson? Try not to hit your head on a shit can behind you. The rest of you candy asses, sticks overhead. wanted to run. Today, we will run that out of you. Left face. Run, march. Left, 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 left. Come on, come on, come on. Oh! So 
what do you think? Leave them all in the cage tonight? Doesn't matter. They're not going to do anything. Yeah, right. A couple of them are about ready to wash out. Yeah. Damn, I hate this job. You'll be going soon. Not soon enough. I don't think I can take much more of this. Casey, shall I leave her in with the rest of them? No. Nope. Logan? He's finished. Leave him with the others. Okay. Better let Bots out for a while. Otherwise, he won't be alive in the morning. After that, it's quitting time. Okay. Suit yourself. I've had it. So bug out. What are you waiting for? You won't qualify. No. I know. I'm just not even sure I care anymore. Well, I sure as hell don't care if you qualify, so why don't you shut up about it? Fuck yourself, Ripken. Hey, Ripken! Ah. 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 Where in the world do you get your energy? It's a good question for you, old man. Let go of me. Or what? I said, let go of me. Samson. Maybe you and I should try and escape. How the hell do you plan to do that in here? Beam yourself up? I'm not talking to you. Conway, Conway, sit down! Conway! Forget him! Forget him! Forget about him. Listen to me. It might be possible if we plan it all. But Work it out. Get right? out of here. <laughs> Got this whole island wired. Can't think your way out of this one, genius. How long have we got to go, do you think? Kind of raw for you, huh, Batsy? For sure. They all hate me, except Logan. I don't hate you, Batsy. As a matter of fact, you're about the best first pigeon I've ever had. Which reminds me. Have you heard any more talk about escape since you've been in there? No, sir. Well, I'll keep your ears open, okay? Yes, sir. Get out. Get your clothes. Jesus, sir, is this all you do for kicks, sir? Oh! 
Now. What's your mission? Sir, Casey, Catherine, Lieutenant, 20118. You better answer me, Lieutenant. You know what happens next. Sir, Casey, Catherine, Lieutenant, 2108. What is it? What's wrong? <sighs> he raped her. What? Becker. He raped me, Lieutenant Casey. What's going on out there? I think you better get out here. We got a guy cracking up on us. Get out of here! 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 Get out of I'm cutting this off! It's over! No exercise! Under Article 135, Code Section 1165! I'm relieving your command! You guys love this shit, don't you? You hear me? Yeah, you really get off me. Get off me! Back here! Stafford! Stafford! I don't know. If you're in on this or not, but there's something very wrong here. And if you don't get the stones off me, you're gonna be on charges too. Are you too stupid, you know, when you see us gone over the edge? The girl's out of control! He's abusing Casey. He raped her. Says who? Just get her out here! No. Come on. Jack, but don't you walk away from me. Did you hear anything I said? Is there someone around here who's safe? Jack, you gonna go down with them? You hear that one? Boss, He's really gone. He's got you raping Lieutenant Casey. Where'd he get that? Beats the hell out of me. It's probably gonna be a pain in the ass for the rest of the course. You know, I think we ought to ship him out of here. Yeah, I'll think about it. Especially if he's come apart. Going back to bed. Please come with me, Major. Where'd you get your information, Major? You've been out here too long, Becker. Why'd you do it? For her own good. Training. I think you actually believe that. She wants to qualify. My job is to provide her with the tools to survive capture. Physically, mentally, and emotionally. You're going up in charge, Becker. You're a fool, Major. 
she isn't. In time she'll see I'm right, and she'll be prepared for whatever happens to her. She's young, ambitious, it's all ahead of her. Unlike you and me. Now, who told you? Stafford? Make it look like an accident. Obvious he got away. Don't you think I should call the base? Not yet. At least then we know what's happening. I want to talk to Twan first. Miller Wilson, stay here. The rest of you, let's go. What's going on out there? Oh, they're after you, Becker and some guards. How many? Most all of them, I think. Not Stafford. Where's Lieutenant Casey? In the isolation shed. Get dressed. Let's go, boss. What are you waiting for? Come on, boss. Let's get a move on it. I need to shout. He's right inside. Come on, move it. Hey, Major! What goes? Logan, take it easy. Take it easy. What the hell is going yeah, on here? Logan, hey, Major, you Look, okay? whatever your problem is, it can be worked out. How many guides left? What are you doing there, Logan? I don't want to have to repeat All right, a couple. Watch out for them. Now, you listen to me. Becker has to be relieved. He tried to kill me. Twan is dead, and I am pulling the plug. I want MPs out here now. That is an order, Stafford. Logan, you guys crack up all the time. I can't take orders from you. I said that he raped Lieutenant Casey. What the hell is going on here? Hot sauce. Becker is a little weird. I am talking about rape. Shh, the guards. Careful, here they come. Come on. Major, they're looking for you. Come on. Hey. What's going on? Right. I want to see some control. Go. Just take it easy. Move it. Easy. All right. Up to you. Dave, Bill, just put him down. Put him down. Do it! Go on, move! Come on, in the middle. Back up! And a boy, boss! Stretch out! All right, boss, way to go! Keep an eye on him. Take many cases. All right, get back there. Get over here. It's good enough. Casey, it's Logan. Logan, what's up? You got your flight suit on. You going somewhere? 
Doesn't seem to be too damn broken up about it now, does she? You just love that, wouldn't you, Sergeant? Oh, my. It doesn't matter. Is this... It doesn't matter. If that doesn't matter, what does? I don't know anymore. Make that call. Take him out. ASAP, investigation team two follow. This is directed General McDonald. Two nine Delta, please confirm. Confirmed. Are you sure he was gonna kill you? Where are we gonna go? We just keep moving till the MPs get here. Look, I'll hold them off as long as I can. Bob, put these guys in the pen. Okay, let's move it. You heard him. Come on. You're gonna have to take bots with you because I'm gonna have to finger him to save my ass. You'll be all right. Yeah, I hope so. Just don't want to lose my stripes. Logan, you know I was just doing my job. You know that. Yeah. I had no idea. I had no idea. Come on. The keys are in the pocket. Get out, boys. Get about the course. Don't do it. Hey, Stop. wait a minute. Wait a minute. What happens when they get back? Ripken, this is an escape. Do it. Don't talk about it. It's a trick. It's a setup just like before. He's not after them. Let's go. Hey, Let's get out of here. I think we should go. I think we should go. Stay all in one group. Okay. I'm not going anywhere. Hey, who cares? Good luck, Logan. You're going to need it. You're making a big mistake. Let's, Let's just go. Let's think of shit. No, no. Nice going, Stafford. Yeah, bots and Casey helping him. Bots? I should have known. I really am ready for the past when I make mistakes like that. What about Casey? Did she say anything? No. 
Well, I mean, she's with him. Well, you should have seen it. He came storming in here all pumped up, takes me down there, we open up the door, there she sits, just as quiet and cool as a cucumber, not saying anything, like nothing had happened. Well, that's when I knew, that's when I knew that uh, he'd gone crazy. But he gives her, uh, he gives her this look, and she buys the whole story. You know, I guess women just can't stand to be alone. Hard to believe, though, isn't it? So many people would tell the same lie. It's too bad. The girl was coming along. She would have qualified, I think. She was right on the edge of understanding her position. A little longer, and she would have known how to handle it. In her gut, she would have known. Yeah, well, Captain, how about getting me out of this? Which way did they go? South. Funny, Miller and Wilson seemed to think they went north. Well, it's hard for me to... <laughs> I would have liked it better if Logan hadn't lost his mind, gone on this rampage. Men who crack under stress can be very dangerous. Yeah, well, how about the... Uh... And I would have preferred that you had been more loyal. Sorry, Stafford, but I'd just as soon be dead as spend time in Leavenworth. They killed Stafford. They're up there somewhere. We'll outflank him. You three go that way, the rest of you that way. Let's go! Thank you. Yes, General McDonald here. What?
got him right here. Drop it down, just beyond the trees. They won't get here. We have to fight. Look, I already killed one man. Bots has two and you're wounded. I'm not gonna just... Oh, this is crazy. This is absolutely crazy! Listen, Logan, why do you think I put up with this? My whole life! I can't lay down and die! Don't you get it? I won't! High ground is defensible. Let's go.
to Becker. pressure up for an answer that would get them off the hook. All I really wanted to know was, did I qualify? When they said yes, that was enough for me. Sort of. They're still waiting for my answer about what I'm going to 